Hey guys, so recently on Twitter, I've seen a ton of talk about the Collector Vision Phoenix, and I wanted to talk about it with you guys. The Collector Vision Phoenix is a new FPGA console that could potentially be awesome for fans of the ColecoVision. If you don't already know, FPGA basically means that it can simulate the original hardware and it's not emulation. It plays all ColecoVision cards, including homebrews, and it has the option to run ROMs off an SD card, so that's pretty cool. It also comes with built-in homebrew games, and I'm not sure how I feel about that. I mean, if they're quality games, then I guess that's one thing, but I think that should have been optional. Much like the Super NT, it only has a HDMI output, which I guess is fine, but I kind of wish it also had composite so you could play it on a CRT. It has the original style controller port, so you can plug in original ColecoVision controllers. It also has a SNES port, which I thought was interesting because you can use a SNES controller, and I kind of like that feature. For the time being, it seems that they do not offer new ColecoVision controllers, but there's a possibility of them adding this in the future. At first, I thought that was kind of weird that they don't already have a new controller announced for it, but then after thinking about it, if you're one of the people that are interested in buying this thing, chances are you already have a bunch of original controllers laying around, so I guess that's not really a big deal. One interesting thing I heard is that it has a PS2 keyboard input, but you can't use a normal keyboard on it, just a PS2 keyboard. I'm guessing this is to like hit the buttons on the original Coleco controller if you don't have one. One cool feature is the Super Game Module, which provides extra RAM and doubles the ColecoVision sound capabilities. I feel like this feature is more for homebrew ColecoVision games because most original ColecoVision games, they're pretty limited when it comes to sound effects and music, so I'm not entirely sure what will happen with this. It apparently might be able to do Atari 2600 games later on at some point, which would be a cool feature that I hope becomes a reality. It would make sense for this to be a thing since the original ColecoVision did have an expansion module that could play 2600 games. It's also significantly smaller than the original console, which is a plus if space is an issue. The original system is a beast, especially if you attach on any of the accessories, like the racing wheel or the roller controller. It seems people are either super excited for this console and they backed it on Kickstarter, or they're tired of hearing about all of these new, old consoles and they just wish it all would stop. And I can't really blame them because it seems like a new mini console or whatever is announced like every week. But if it's a quality product with cool features, then I'm down. So what do you guys think of the Collector Vision Phoenix? Do you think it's cool? Have you already backed it on Kickstarter? Do you think it sucks and you just wish all of this new console stuff would stop? Let me know in the comments. And don't forget to tap that bell icon so you can be notified every time I release a new video. Thanks for watching. Potentially awesome. Potentially. 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 So what do you guys think of the Collector Vision Mini? I mean, shit.